Hello everyone, it's Kritika from IT Rebels and today we have a challenge to build our very own uh, ERC20 token. So here we are, we have created this uh, a simple smart contract with name simple token and we are we are going to inherit uh, all the parent code from ERC20 uh, contract from Open Zeppelin and we are just inheriting that in our token in our contract and uh, we have created a con constructor which will give a name to our token called simple and the symbol of that token will be sim just like ether uh, eth for ether uh, and it will uh, this erc20 token uh, will provide us a function called mint which will mint uh, which, which will help us to mint new tokens so here in constructor we are just minting 100 new token once we deploy our smart contract so let's deploy it and see the result so we have deployed in remix virtual machine uh, here is what we uh, here is the result what we get from this contract and by inheriting from ERC20, we got all this uh, functionality just with the help of this four line of code. So let's see the total supply of our token, which is 100 uh, into uh, the number of decimals, right? So the decimal is 18, so which is 100 and then 18 zeros. The name of the token is simple and the symbol is sim allowance uh, so initially we, i got uh, confused what is allowance and approve what is decrease allowance increase allowance uh, it is very easy to understand just let me show you what i have understand from that so we can just check the balance of an address here by you calling this balance of function and we can check the balance of that account right so we can also transfer money from one account to another right so we have to put the sender uh, okay uh, on only if i own this account right i am using currently this account so i can transfer money from this account to any other account so let's say this copy that address go back to that address and transfer money from my address to address a to address b the amount will be 10 away and let's transact so now this address b will own 10 as you can see 10 way or something called 10 points of that token so now let's understand what is allowance and approve and disapprove so we can transfer our own money from we can transfer money from our own account to another account right so what if uh, i want someone to transfer money from someone uh, transfer money from my account let's say there is account b uh, which i account a uh, give want to give a permission to uh, transact from my account and use it somewhere else so we have to approve uh, account B address to use our account so spender we want to approve account B to spend 100 points for for us so we have approved that 100 points to this uh, spender and we can check the allowance of that approval uh, spender so expander and the owner owner is me copy this yep uh, so this owner has uh, approved uh, this address uh, this spender of 200 amounts there is transform from function uh, like we have approved uh, we have given the allowance to this spender then this spender can transact from this address from account A owner address to any other account like any other smart contract or any other account uh, let's say he wants to transfer himself so 
account account will be like they have uh, he have the hundred hundred token balance like a launch so let's say he want to use 90 of that transact it's failed i don't think we are okay the alliance was this transact it will succeed and once we check this balance it is 100 because 10 was before and added 90 which is 100 and the allowance will be 10 remaining so this is how it works and the owner can decrease the allowance or increase the allowance there can be many allowance given to same uh, given to a single spender or th there can be many uh, approved account by the spender uh, by the owner yeah that's it that's our smart contract